as a hurler, you, you kind of want to be at the end of the year and in the big games. This is what it's all about now, quarterfinals, semi-finals, and this is where the, I suppose the reward for this next weekend is going to be a place in semi-final against Tipperary. Losing the Leinster final is not the end of the world, it can be a bonus if you win it, but you just need to kind of get lads' heads mentally in the right way. Not that they can be just worrying about their own game and, and, and kind of get that approach going again within a short space of time. It can be a good way and, and an extra game can be a good thing if you're, if you're to challenge for the all at the end of the day. One of the main goals we had at the start of the year was to get back to Crow Park and we're one step we're one step away from that now at the moment. So I think every hurler wants to be hurling into August and, and if possible hurling into September with their county. We're back in a quarter final. We haven't been in one since 2013 and the last time we were in one before that was 2008. So we don't get them too often. So it's, it's nice to be back. That game against Limerick was obviously a massive game. There was an awful lot at stake for, for both setups, for both, both players, both managements, everything. There was an awful lot at stake and it was vital that we got over that one and we did. Um, did we play particularly well? I don't know, really. We played well in patches, but I think there's an awful lot of improvement. It bodes well to be a, a free free scoring game. I would think um, like some serious forwards on both sides, you have to look at it like the likes of Podge Collins, Tony Kelly, Shane O'Donnell, and the likes of Cahill Mannion, Conor Wheel and Joe Cannon that we have. So it should be a good old good old tussle. Uh, it'll probably come down to who can defend better on the day. So uh, we'd be hoping we can get that over them. The last day we, we played well in patches, but we haven't, I suppose, got the consistency over the 70 minutes. We seem to play well in, in, in spells of maybe 15 minutes and, and then seem to die out of games. And when teams get on top of us, it's hard to claw it back. So I suppose just to get that consistency for a full 70 minutes is what we'll be looking for. Galway are a very, very good team and you can never underestimate a Galway team there. They're after losing the last day, so they're going to want to put a couple of uh, wrongs right the next day. And, and we're in the same situation, so it should be a good game.